Hello everyone, I'm down at my 12 unit and I wanted to shoot a quick video. This is a 12 unit with six on the front, six on the back. Shoot a quick video about multifamily mailboxes or they're better known as cluster mailboxes. So the way these work, each tenant has their own individual key in the front. They come to the front to get their mail and your mailman has a master key that he can open in the back and that gives him access to all the mailboxes. So a couple issues you may run into, I know when I bought my 12 unit here, the former owner didn't keep track of all the keys. So every time a tenant lost a key or a tenant moved out and didn't return the key, you have to drill these out if you don't have the key. So these locks are available on Amazon. They're called uh, mailbox locks. Here's what they look like. Set this down. And so all you really have to do is just run out a quarter inch drill bit through these and then take a screwdriver. It takes a little messing around, but you can break these free and get access and put in your new lock that you can easily purchase on Amazon or the post office sells them to other places sell them. The other thing I just had to do was uh, the post had been hit multiple times, but someone finally uh, knocked it over. My wife actually hit it once too with her van when she was down here, but, but it finally got wiped out. Once again, these posts are available and they're sold separately from the cluster mailbox, but it was on Amazon. I think it was about $120 for an aluminum uh, post. And you can see, you'll see I shortcut it, only put in two screws underneath here, but you'll need access to the mailboxes um, where the, the uh, screws are located so you can get in there and get a wrench on them. And then on the concrete, you can see where the it used to be over here. You'll have to drill into the concrete with, with the masonry bit and uh, put new concrete anchors in. But that's a fairly easy fix. Um, these mailboxes, you don't want to replace them if you can avoid it. They're, they're pretty expensive. I think a set like this is probably around five, six hundred bucks for this set. So fix them as much as you can, keep them working. So I hope that helps you. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Thanks.